Hi everyone, Diamond Peter here. I have two canvases to show you today. Um, I was going to show you these on the weekend while I was visiting my mum and dad, but I didn't get a chance to do it, so I apologise for that. So we're going to do it today. Today is Monday, the 5th of August. It is nearly 12pm here, so nearly lunchtime. I've got back not long ago from mum and dad's and um, I unpacked the car and then went and did grocery shopping and came back and I thought I'd do these before I have lunch. So I picked these up at a shop I went to visit with my daughter last Friday uh, here in Australia called The Reject Shop. Now I believe it's very similar to Poundland or Dollar Tree. Um, it's a budget friendly shop and they sell all sorts of all sorts of things. Um, Food, from food to clothing to dog stuff like toys, dog toys, sorry, I'm bumping the, um, to diamond paintings and craft stuff. So I picked both of these up for $5 each. Now, there were three of these and the other one was a, <clears throat> the other one was a, a mother koala and a baby. But when I picked it up to look at it, it was very pixelated. I don't think it would have turned out as good as as I would have thought so I left that one and I picked these two up because I think these two will be fine so let's do this one first you know I love sunflowers so I got this one it's a diamond art kit crafters solutions must be the brand um, so let's see what it says more than 13,000 rhinestones it comes with the canvas the pen the clay or the wax the rhinestones, the tray, and an instruction sheet. And the back of it, obviously, is just a plain box. So let's have a look. Now, these are budget friendly, so there's not going to be a lot in them. Okay, so there's an instruction sheet that shows you how to diamond paint, which is nice for new people because, you know, you might not know how to get started. So that's a really nice little, little sheet. <coughs> Sorry, I've got a tickle in my throat today. Okay, so let's have a look at this one. Sorry for the crinkling. Now, you know I don't do many canvases. I prefer to do the special um, off-canvas items, but sometimes I just want a canvas that I might want to start and just leave sitting there and in my craft room and come back to every now and then. So that's why I decided to get a few canvases lately. And also for events and things that are going on. Uh, so we've got the pen, the boat, what we call the tray or the boat and the wax. And that's the kit. We have our diamonds are on the silver trains. Now I'm not going to take these out because they're, you can see all the colours there. A lot of autumn type colours because it's sunflowers. I'd be curious to know where this purple, this purple goes because uh, it doesn't look like there's much purple on the front of the box. A bit of pink there too. Burgundy. Okay, so let's have a look. I'm just going to roll this back the other way first. This is, let me just make sure it's poured glue, not double-sided tape. Ooh, the cover's quite thick too. It's really hard to, to get off. Um, yes, it's poured glue, so that's fine. I can fold it up the other way. If you get double-sided tape, it's not advised that you fold it back the opposite way because um, it can leave rivers in your diamond painting. So let's have a look at this one. <clears throat> okay, so that's it there. So we've got the vase. And there is a lot of purple in it, I didn't realise. There's a lot of purple down here and in the bars. And then you've got the beautiful sunflowers up the top there. So, yeah, the, the plastic's actually quite thick on these. But, yeah, that's, that's definitely poured glue. Very sticky. But, yeah, so that's the first one. And I'm thinking these are 30 by 40. Yeah, so that's the sunflower one. So that's quite pretty. I might be able to, and the canvas has got glitter. I don't know if you can see that, but the canvas is glittery as well. So I might um, 
one day start one of these and just leave it on my craft desk in there and then I can come back to it when I want to do some every now and then and just um, do my special projects in between. There's the drill field. It's very clear, as you can see. I don't think there's... There's no... Um, okay, there's no key on this one. That's interesting. Maybe because it's a budget-friendly... Hmm, there's no key, so let's hope that all the diamonds are there. Let me just have a quick look. So it looks like we've got numbers and letters. And I'm hoping that all the colours are there because there's no, yeah, there's no key on this at all, as you can see. So anyway, that's okay. So that's the uh, sunflower one. I would have liked the koala one, but yeah, I just wasn't, I just looked at it and thought, mm, it doesn't look very clear, it's quite pixelated, so I didn't want to go there. And the second one is this beautiful bird. I don't know what sort of a bird that is, but whether it's a hummingbird, oh yes, it could be a hummingbird because of the, sorry, the size of the beak. When we open it, we'll have a look, but yeah, so this one has the same sort of stuff. This one's actually sealed on top, the other one isn't. <clears throat> we have our instructions in here again and it's nice because they have the actual pictures on the instructions so this one's got the picture of the bird the other one's got the picture of the sunflowers sometimes you get a generic one that's just got a picture of anything on it but yeah so that's quite nice let's have a look at this one How is everyone today anyway? It's, um, it's still quite cold here at the moment. Um, we've got all, all of August to go for winter and then 1st of September is spring here in Australia. So I'm looking forward to that um, basic toolkit. We have our train again with our numbers and symbols and things on the bags, which I'm hoping that they are all there. We've got some beautiful colours in this one. Look at that rainbow. Oh, absolutely beautiful. Gorgeous colours. Okay. <clears throat> I'll just roll this back the other way. bird so it is a hummingbird so we've got like a little flower up here we've got the hummingbird with his beautiful wings and his tail down here and then we've got some flowers down the bottom I don't know how well these will turn out but yeah it's the beautiful beautiful absolutely beautiful colors again there's no key um, which is fine as long as all the colors are there I will check the colours later to make sure they're all there. Um, again, the drill field is very clear. Yep. Very, very clear. Excellent. All right. Well, that is all I have for you guys. I just wanted to quickly come on and do this and show you these. I'm going to have lunch and then after lunch, <clears throat> I will come back and do a whip and chat. And let you know what I've been up to. Um, been a bit going on and um, good stuff and yeah, just been busy. You've just been really flat out and been busy and haven't had time to, I haven't even had time to diamond paint. I haven't even started those Father's Day keychains that I need to get done for next month. But I'll, I will start them. We might start those today when I do my whip and chat. So, but yeah, I'll be back in a little while. I'm going to post this up now and I will see you all very soon again um please give my video a like um thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already hi to all my new subscribers and i will see you very soon for a whip and chat bye guys